Hey guys, I'm here today to show you how easy and how quick it is to remove the background from an image using the Photo Fox uh, application. You can download this in your iOS store or your app store. Uh, so let's go ahead and just jump right into it. So we're gonna go ahead and open the Photo Fox um, app. We're gonna click this little uh, plus where it says your creation. Let's go ahead and open that. And today I want to show you how we're gonna remove the background. Um, his name here is Abdil. So you can see Abdil is standing in front of a gray wall in the background, right? So let's go ahead and remove that. Super easy using this app. You're gonna press the little erase button in the bottom right hand corner, see right here? And all you're gonna do is click auto, right? Auto's automatically gonna get rid of his background. So now, now he's on a transparent background. But if you zoom in, you use two fingers to pinch in, to zoom in, you can see there's some like ghosting on the edge right here, right? So we're gonna go ahead, you have the erase tool still pulled up. This is a smart app. So if you start erasing close, you can see it here and by his ear and by his face mask, it automatically like molds to the outline. And if you're just very patient, you could get this really, really refined. Even up here, up into his hair, you can get very refined. You see how there's some um, shadowing or not shadowing, but like some fringing around here. You can get really close. Now this I suggest you do on a, on a tablet if you can, because it's much easier. Or if you get a stylus for your iPhone, it's also very easy to do. And you just kind of go away at it, plug away at it, um, and you just go from there. You don't want any of this overlay though. Um, you can see here, you see how I'm erasing this overlay? Because that will show up in your transparent background. So even in his hair right here, you see that how his hair kind of just went away? That's not gonna look natural if I zoom out. See now it looks like his hair got cut out. So what we're gonna do, you could actually do that by accident. Look, I cut out too much of his hair. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to restore, zoom back in, and restore actually fills that back in. So it's a great tool to have. So now having a little bit of white on the edges it's fine, it's not, gonna, it's not the end of the world because if you're gonna put him on a white background, if you're gonna put him on a white background, then it's not gonna matter too much. And you'll see what I mean right now. Okay, so let, let me erase the rest of all this stuff around him. Let's get in tight, erase this, uh, all right. So this is just very quick, oops. I accidentally erased some of his head, so. Let's keep going, let's keep going, check all the edges. We got all this here. We don't want any of the shadow overlay. Let's keep going. Uh, it actually looks pretty decent now. Maybe along here, yep. You see that, how it's erasing along here. And then, so the auto is not always perfect. You can see it erased a lot of his lower half right here. We want to restore that. So we're gonna fill that back in. All right. So now that that's filled back in, just wanna do this really quick for you guys. I don't want this video to be too long. You're just gonna pinch out. And now we have him on a trans, trans, uh, um, get transparent background, okay? So we're done with this. So let's go ahead and create a layer. We're gonna click back. This takes you, now this whole frame is in, in, uh, in I can't think today, sorry. This whole frame is uh, selected. So now we're gonna go ahead and click this little plus. It's gonna create a new layer and we're just gonna do a fill layer, right? So this layer is on top of this picture. So we're gonna go ahead and hold and drag this down. Bam, now he's on a white background. And we could go ahead and change this accordingly if we wanna change the color, come down here and now he's on a blue background, purple, pink, whatever, orange, like that. That's awesome. That just looks great. And it just adds a whole nother dimension uh, for your clients whenever you're gonna um, cut out any sort of item. You can do this with food, you can do this with people, you can do this with animals, whatever you like. Clothes, this is great with clothes. Um, so this is the PhotoFox app. There's tons of great, uh, tons of great features in here that are just an artistic person's uh, like dream. So go ahead and check this out if you're not too good at using uh, Photoshop, this is perfect for anybody who's a beginner at, ed <clears throat> at editing. So I hope you enjoyed this quick video. Make sure to click like and subscribe below. Uh, I've got a lot of new tutorials coming out, how to um, how to edit, how to take photos. It's gonna be, I mean, a lot of people have done this before, but 
I'm gonna be a little bit different because I wanna take this as a, as a business aspect because I do social media management. So make sure to follow me on Instagram at raw photo, that's R-A-W-F-O-T-O. And then uh, make sure to subscribe, share this with your friends, anybody who think you may, you may think who's interested in learning more. And I appreciate your time.